So I taught a class today on the Realtor Code of Ethics. And in part of that class, we cover the preamble to the Code of Ethics. And it occurred to me that this would be a really, really great video. The preamble to the Realtor Code of Ethics is, I find, a very uh, moving piece of prose that I think all real estate agents uh, need to revisit, regardless if you are a realtor or not a realtor. And in our industry, I just wanted to share this with you and again, thought it would make a good video. Hi, everybody. Dana Sparks, broker of Maximum One Greater Atlanta Realtors and the director of the Real Estate Academy of America. And real estate is, is a very, very important and noble profession. And the preamble to the Code of Ethics uh, does remind us of this. And again, I wanted to share. It is also a very interesting profession uh, in that there are two sides and buyers and sellers each have their own representation. But unlike other uh, uh, venues where there are two sides with representation, for example, a law of court, real estate is vastly different. In a real estate transaction, both sides are working towards the same ultimate goal, a seller who wants to sell and a buyer who wants to buy. Now, each buyer and seller have their own representation to look out for their best interests, but it is not an adversarial relationship. Again, the end result is the same goal. So let me share with you the preamble and... I hope that you find these words as moving as I do every time I read them. So again, this is the preamble to the Realtor Code of Ethics. I believe these are important tenets for our public to hear, as well as for every real estate agent, regardless if you are a realtor or not. Under all is the land. Upon its wise utilization and widely allocated ownership, depend the survival and growth of free institutions and of our civilization. Realtors should recognize that the interests of the nation and its citizens require the highest and best use of the land and the widest distribution of land ownership. They require the creation of adequate housing, the building of functioning cities, the development of productive industries and farms, and the preservation of a healthful environment. Such interests impose obligations beyond those of ordinary commerce. They impose grave social responsibility and a patriotic duty to which realtors should dedicate themselves and for which they should be diligent in preparing themselves. Realtors, therefore, are zealous to maintain and improve the standards of their calling and share with their fellow realtors a common responsibility for its integrity and honor. In recognition and appreciation of their obligations to clients, customers, the public, and each other, realtors continuously strive to become and remain informed on issues affecting real estate and, as knowledgeable professionals, they willingly share the fruit of their experience and study with others. They identify and take steps through enforcement of this code of ethics and by assisting appropriate regulatory bodies to eliminate practices which may damage the public or which might discredit or bring dishonor to the real estate profession. Realtors having direct personal knowledge of conduct that may violate the code of ethics involving misappropriation of client or customer funds or property, willful discrimination, or fraud resulting in substantial economic harm, bring such matters to the attention of the appropriate board or association of realtors. Realizing that cooperation with other real estate professionals promotes the best interest of those who utilize their services. Realtors urge exclusive representation of clients, do not attempt to gain any unfair advantage over their competitors, and they refrain from making unsolicited comments about other practitioners. 
In instances where their opinion is sought or where realtors believing that comment is necessary, their opinion is offered in an objective, professional manner, uninfluenced by any personal motivation or potential advantage or gain. The term realtor has come to connote competency, fairness, and high integrity, resulting from adherence to a lofty ideal of moral conduct in business relations. No inducement of profit and no instruction from clients can ever justify departure from this ideal. In the interpretation of this obligation, realtors can take no safer guide than that which has been handed down through the centuries embodied in the golden rule. Whatsoever ye would that others should do to you, do ye even so to them. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Accepting this standard as their own, realtors pledge to observe its spirit in all of their activities, whether conducted personally, through associates or others, or via technological means, and to conduct their business in accordance with the tenets set forth below. So again, I just uh, wanted to share that with all real estate agents, as well as with our buyers and our sellers, um, the importance of real estate as an industry. And I hope you too find those words moving. Thank you so much, Dana Sparks, broker of Maximum One Greater Atlanta Realtors, satisfying your needs with service, innovation, and education. Bye. If you like that video, check out the one here. If you like the content on this entire channel, please click here to subscribe. I try to take even the most complicated of real estate situations and make them crystal clear. See what I did there? Real estate made crystal clear. Thank you guys so much for watching.